This is the 2017 Mini Winnie or Spirit 26A. Based upon a Ford E450 chassis, it features a 6.8 liter Ford V10 coupled with a six speed transmission. This motorhome was built with the optional front cap, one piece fiberglass. You can see the stainless steel wheel liners. You have a couple of choices on the exterior of these. The motorhome on the right is the standard graphics. You can also get it with just a white body as well. And this is the deluxe graphics. So you have those choices. You can see the new running boards for easy entry into the cab area. This motorhome was equipped with quite a few options including side turn cameras. Electric awning. You can see on the activity side of the coach you have outlets for a TV, for cable, a couple of electrical outlets. You have some storage bins along the side. You have a nice storage bin across the back here which could also be very convenient for fishing poles, flag poles, some of your longer items. Nice light back here in this compartment. Motorhome already has a hitch with a 7-pin connector. Ladder so you can access the roof area. You can see that all of the slide rooms, this being a three-slide coach, come with a slide topper, a steel bumper. Check kind of the business side of the motorhome over here. Again, you're noticing the slide toppers. Now let's go look at the inside of this brand new 26A Class C. As we come up and into the motorhome, the first thing you're going to notice is we're actually going to step over the dual house batteries. One piece linoleum floor throughout. This motorhome was given the Premier package which features upgraded interior inserts on the cabinet doors, MCD day-night shades, a whole variety of items which you can find spelled out on our website. The large cab over sleeping area, one of the largest cab over bunks in the industry. TV on a swing in swing out bracket, DVD player above the door. Ultra leather covers on the driver and passenger seat. You can see the in-dash monitor. Also has this motorhome was built with the satellite radio option. You can see the optional booster cushions. Kind of when you have those seats swiveled around raises you up a little bit. The very nice U-shaped dinette, which can also double as a bed. Most Class C's are lacking. If they're lacking anything, it's storage space. This motorhome has a very large pull-out pantry in the galley area. Notice how each of these has pull-out drawers on metal guides. Six of them total, so plenty of room in the uh, galley area on this motorhome. You can see a child car seat tether. Sliding door to block off the back part of the coach. You can, in essence, create a three-room motorhome. Glass shower door. You notice how the door to the toilet and sink area will swing over and block that off. Again, creating that three distinctive rooms. Plenty of storage in a bathroom, stainless steel bowl, sink. This has the rear bed slide, so it creates a lot of nice room as that goes out. Large overhead storage cabinets. MCD nighttime shades in the back part of the coach. In the front part of the coach you have day-night shades. The optional bedroom TV. So really a lot of the Class A style conveniences you're finding in a Class C. And then lastly, the third slide on this motorhome is the closet slide. A lot of times in a Class C you're giving up hanging space. You can see you have as much hanging space and drawer space down below as you do in a lot of the similar size Class A motorhomes. Back down the front into the galley, you can notice the nice panels on it, glass stovetop cover, inserts on the fridge door, 
just give it that new modern look. Optional convection microwave, solid surface countertops with undermount sinks, and a residential style faucet. Really gives this motor home a very, very nice look. Drawers, cabinets, backsplash looks really good in here. Again, this is the 26A by Winnebago.